Alright, so today we are going to look at the property of uh, associativity and a binary operation. Okay, alright. So if A star B star C is equal to A star B star C, where A, B, and C are all real numbers, then the binary operation star is associative. Okay, so for any closed binary operation the binary operation is said to be associative if a star b star c is equal to a star b star c so uh, let's take a look at some of the basic associative binary operations for example if i have these three real numbers or if i pick two three and four from the set of real numbers if I want to add these three real numbers, this is 2 plus 3 plus 4, I can decide to add the first two numbers before the last one, and I will get the same result if I decide to add the last two numbers before the first one. Is that okay? Yes. So if someone decides to add the first two numbers before the third one, and again, someone also decided to add the last two numbers before the first one. If they get the same result, then we say that the operation addition is what? Associative. So um, we add 2 plus 3, and 2 plus 3 is given as 5, plus 4. And the result is the same as 2 plus 3 plus 4, which is given as what? 7. And so 5 plus 4 is what? 9 which is equal to 2 plus 7. Is that okay? So we are getting 9 in each of the cases. Therefore, we see that addition of real numbers is associative. All right. Then also looking at the same numbers, 2, 3, and 4 from the set of real numbers. If we want to multiply these three numbers, 2 times 3 times 4, we can decide to multiply the first two numbers before multiplying the result with the last one. We are going to get the same result as multiplying the last two numbers before multiplying the result with the first one. So in multiplying these three numbers, if someone decides to multiply the first two numbers before the third one, and the person gets the same result as the one who multiplies the last two numbers first, then we say in multiplication of real numbers is what? associative and so 2 times 3 is given as 6 times 4 that's the same as 2 times 3 times 4 which is what 12 and so 6 times 4 is given as 24 and the same as what 2 times 12 which is also 24 therefore we say that the multiplication of real numbers is what associative then again the same numbers 2 3 and 4 someone can decide to first subtract 3 from what? 2, okay? Is the person going to get the same result as the one who decides to first subtract 4 from where? 3? Alright, let's check that and see. So, um, 2 minus 3, 2 minus 3 is giving us what? Negative 1 minus 4. Will the result be the same as 2 minus 3 minus 4? which is negative 1 okay good so negative 1 minus 4 is negative 5 and then 2 minus negative 1 is what? 3 which is not equal to negative 5 and so we say that subtraction of real numbers is not associative okay alright the same way division of real numbers is not associative because if we want to divide these three numbers if we decide to first divide 2 by 3, that is not equal to the result you get when you divide 3 by 4 first. Okay, or 2 divided by 3 um, is 2 over 3 divided by 4, and the result is not equal to 2 divided by 3 over 4. Okay, to test divided by 4 is given as 1 sixth, and then 2 divided by 3 over 4 that's what each over three which is not equal to one over six therefore we say division of real numbers is not associative all right so just as a reminder addition and multiplication of real numbers is what associative
because if you decide to add three in a mix regardless of which two you add first you are going to get the same result um, on the other side subtraction and division of real numbers is not associative all right so let's look at a couple of examples on the binary operations so we have a problem here which says that a binary operation s defined as a star b is equal to a plus b plus a b yeah asked to first evaluate 2 star 3 star 4 and then again evaluate 2 star 3 star 4 okay and then we ask whether the binary operation is associative okay so let's quickly begin with uh, a i 2 star 3 star 4 we are going to solve this problem using the defined operation which is a star b is equal to a plus b plus a b so in this case we are going to first deal with the bracket first okay we are going to deal with the bracket first so in this case our a is 2 and then our b is what 3 so wherever we find a in the definition we are going to put 2 and wherever we find b we are going to put what three okay so we are going to solve the bracket first maintaining the four by it is that okay okay good so we have two plus three plus two times three that is for the bracket okay star four good so we then simplify what we have in the square bracket so two plus three is five and two times three is six star 4 okay we are going to keep the star by it then simplify whatever we have in the bracket so 5 plus 6 is giving us what 11 star 4 good we then again have to use the defined operation to evaluate this so in this case our a is what 11 and our b is what 4 so now whatever we find a we are going to put 11 and wherever we find b we are going to put what 4 so we have 11 plus 4 plus 11 times 4 okay and this is giving us what 59 good so that is for the ai so let's go to the aii so now we are having 2 star 3 star 4 we have to evaluate the bracket first keeping the 2 by it so in this our case our a is what 3 and our b is what 4 so wherever we find a we are going to put 3 in a definition and wherever we find b we are going to put 4 so we have 2 star into bracket 3 plus 4 plus 3 times 4 so have 2 star then we simplify what we have in the bracket we are getting what 19 so now we have our a to be 2 and our b to be what 19 so wherever we find a we are going to put 2 wherever we find b we are going to put 19 then we simplify so we have 2 plus 19 plus 2 times what 19 which is giving us what 59 is that okay good so we have answered the first part the a let's move on to the b it's the operation associative now in the definition we were given that the operation is associative if a star b star c is equal to a star b star c okay so we've solved for 2 star 3 star 4 and we got 59 then again we are we solved 2 star 3 star 4 and also we got what 59 so you realize that 2 star 3 star 4 is equal to 2 star 3 star 4 so since 2 star 3 star 4 is equal to 2 star 3 star 4 we say that the operation star is what associative let's look at another example so if a star b is equal to 2a minus b evaluate 5 star 2 star 7 and is the operation associative good so quickly we have to look at this problem and let's solve the a first yeah we have to evaluate this the binary operation has been defined for us as a star b is equal to 2a minus b 
and now our a is 5 and then our b is what 2 so wherever we find a in the definition we put 5 and wherever we find b we put 2 so we are going to solve the bracket first keeping the 7 by it okay good so we have 2 times 5 minus 2 in the bracket star 7 good so we simplify what we have in the bracket so we have 2 times 5 is 10 minus 2 star 7 good so 10 minus 2 is giving us what 8 and we have star 7 all right so now again we have our a to be 8 and then the b to be what 7 so you substitute and you are getting 2 times 8 minus what 7 and that is giving us what 9 good uh, let's try and answer the uh, the b part is the operation associative all right if the operation is associative then 5 star 2 star 7 must be equal to 5 star 2 star 7 okay if we perform the operation on the first two numbers the result should be the same as performing the operation on the last two numbers first so if the result are the same then we can say the operation is what associative all right and then we have the first part 5 star 2 star 7 being 9 but we don't have the second part 5 star 2 star 7 so we need to find that so let's quickly find that and see what we are getting so 5 star 2 star 7 again we have to deal with the bracket first okay deal with the bracket first keeping the 5 by it so our a in this case is 2 and the b is what 7 so we have 5 star solving the bracket first we have 2 times 2 minus what 7 you simplify the bracket and you're having 5 star when you simplify the bracket you have what negative 3 good so again we have 5 star negative 3 and then our a in this case is what 5 and then the b is negative 3 you substitute into the definition and you are getting 13 so now you realize that 5 star 2 star 7 is giving us 9 and 5 star 2 star 7 is giving us what 13 so you realize that they are not the same 5 star 2 star 7 is not equal to 5 star 2 star 7 so in answering the B part we say that since 5 star 2 star 7 is not equal to 5 star 2 star 7 we conclude that the operation star is not associative thanks for watching